Hello, uh, here we with Electra for the win, and I'm gonna be showing you how to make an online zombie panic source server. Okay, first you go into Steam, then you go to Library, Library, and then you go into Tools, and then you can find the game you want to. But now I'm gonna be showing you with zombie panic source. Then you click Download, and then when it's finished, you open it. Then you choose the game you want. Now it's Zombie Pink Sauce. Call it so it wants to. I'm gonna co be calling it this. Choose the map you want to choose. I'm gonna be choosing. I'll just be choosing cinema. Then you can have it LAN or internet, but we want it internet so other people can join us. And then the server port. I will. Um, Make a little video how to port forward so you can have it online, but then you use the port you made and choose how many players you want, make a password, one, two, three, and then we just start server. Wait a bit. I'll pause and be back when it's finished. Okay, it's finished. Then you can see the server. You got like console where you can ban and kick players. You got all kinds of stuff. This server name, internet. Then you can see how many players there's on the server. And this is the IP. But if to ch check if it's online, you right click servers. Then just write zombie panic at server. Then this is my IP. You go into an IP chicken. I'll write the link in the description. Then you write your IP. Find IP. Then you can see this is for other players. How the IP looks for other players. This is the IP and that means that it's online. If it doesn't come up, well it won't because if you follow my instructions then yeah. Well, this is how you make a s this is how you make a online server to Sami Panic Sauce, and I'll see you in the next video where I'll make I'll do a port forward video. This was Electro for the win. I'll see you next.